if you are looking at universal health coverage, then the key word is access. There is three billion people in the world that have no access to healthcare, let alone high quality healthcare. Most of these three billion people are living in low and middle income countries, but also in industrialized countries, when you are living in remote areas, your access to care is not as good as it could be. Now, this access to care can be improved by using digital solutions, telehealth, remote monitoring, having the patient at home using applications that he can use on his iPhone or on his tablet to do remote diagnosis, to have remote contacts face-to-face -face or disconnected with a doctor somewhere else in the country or even somewhere else in the world. So the access part of the universal health coverage uh, idea or plan is helped enormously by digital solutions. These, these digital solutions and this artificial or adaptive intelligence associated with it which also, will also help low and middle income countries. We know from a lot of studies that 80% of the chronic diseases, cardiac diseases, respiratory diseases, oncology, diabetes, occur in low and middle income countries where the shortage of doctors is the highest. The most important take home message for myself when I participated in the panel this morning on universal healthcare coverage is the absolute need for collaboration, for partnerships. Nobody can solve this problem alone. So let's lock arms, go the way and the whole journey together, patients, governments, healthcare systems, as well as the industry, foundations, and make universal health coverage a reality.